Hello everyone! Today, Tony and I are going to tell you about the most sophisticated torture methods ever used. And we are going to see if they work on Tony, our favorite guinea pig. <laughs> Let's begin with a torture that was invented back in ancient China. It involves the use of salt. The prisoner would be fed with oversalted food, while not being allowed to drink fresh water. This would disturb the fluid balance of the body, increasing the level of sodium in the blood and causing heavy dehydration. The tortured person would feel very bad and won't be able to move even a finger. This also causes constipation, lethargy, hallucinations, and soon after, the person will enter a coma and will die. But this only happens after many weeks of agony. By the way, you could do the opposite and use water to torture someone. In Europe, between the 15th and the 18th century, the following method was very popular among torturers. The victim would be tied to a chair with their head up. Then, with the help of a funnel, the prisoner would be given water, lots of water. Apart from feeling like you're choking and the pain from a swelling stomach, the effects from the torture would last pretty long. All the cells on your body would swell from the excess of water, causing nausea, vomiting, and convulsions. And soon after, you will die from a cerebral edema along with respiratory failure. And last but not least, let's use what silence and darkness can do to people. This kind of torture was used in ancient Rome. Back then, there were special chambers for prisoners, whose crimes weren't bad enough to have them killed, but who still deserved something more than physical punishment. The prisoners were put in a sealed dark chamber with a good ventilation system. The food would be given to the prisoners from a dark room above, so not even a tiny ray of light would get to them. The guards would be very quiet and won't talk with the prisoner. After some months, the chamber was opened and a toothless and often blind crazy person would go out. The thing is that the lack of sunlight would cause a deficiency of vitamin D. The prisoner would suffer from scurvy, a disease that affects the connective tissue of the body, makes your teeth fall out, cause rash and terrible pain in the joints. In the end, darkness, silence, and constant pain make the prisoner go crazy and lose any grip of reality. <gasps> whoa, whoa, Tony. Did you have a nightmare? You thought someone was torturing you? Don't worry, Tony. We would never do that. Go back to sleep, poor thing. Friends, tell us in the comments if you know any other unusual torture methods. The best ideas will be featured in the next episode. Give us a like and subscribe so you won't miss any of Super Tony's experiments. Bye-bye!